Credit card. Now you probably drive on them every day. A new scathing audit from the city itself says more than a third of roads around the city are in poor or even worse condition. Last year's crews fixed more than 9,000 potholes, but they simply can't keep up with the demand with all the rough roads out there. Our reporter Carla Castaño is live at Portland City Hall right now. Carla, I know you've been looking into this. The audit says it would cost $75 million over the next 10 years just to fix the roads in Portland. That's right, Kelly. That's just to get the roads up to proper condition. And the mayor told us today here at City Hall, he just doesn't know where the money is going to come from. I would be skipping around the building if it turned out that we have enough money in the budget today to take care of this whole problem. But the damage to Portland's roads isn't an issue that shocked Portlanders we talked to. I mean, there, there's always some place that's in bad condition. Even when we told them it would take 10 years to get back on track. I'm not surprised. I mean, growing up here, it's kind of been the same thing since um, it, it, I just don't ever see them really getting fixed, and it does concern me. Some Portlanders we met did express frustration that so much money was spent on light rail, street cars, and bike lanes while the streets suffered. So we asked Mayor Charlie Hales about it. But are our priorities straight in terms of keeping our roads safe? I think our priorities are, are not straight in that we haven't focused on maintenance. You know, no matter what else we've been doing, those, those have to come in second to maintenance. The audit found the roads cost 10 times as much to repair once degraded than they do to maintain. And Mayor Hale says former Mayor Sam Adams made some choices that are making his job now harder, like selling off all the trucks that put down asphalt sealant on the roadway. That just made me want to pound my head against the door uh, when I heard that. Despite the challenges, the mayor says he is going to create a budget that prioritizes maintenance and then focus on where to find new revenue. Well, this audit is a real wake-up call. The mayor says he's hired a new transportation director, which he says should also help. Reporting for you live in downtown Portland tonight, Carla Castaño, Coin Local 6. Carla, thank you.